Hi there, and in this Light Rider Tips video, I'm going to walk through the purchase of the ArtNet license. So, at the moment, my iPad is connected to my ADJ Airstream DMX bridge. And if I attempt to connect to it at the moment, you'll see I get the little pop up message that says, Please purchase ArtNet to use this device. Now, to be able to make that purchase, first of all, I'm going to need to be connected to my home network or at least a network with an internet connection because right now my uh, ADJ Airstream bridge um, is running uh, in kind of standalone mode. So I'm just going to switch to set iPad, tap Wi Fi, and then select my home network. Okay, give this a second to connect. So Light Rider is no longer. Uh, sorry, my iPad is no longer connected to my Airstream bridge, so therefore that did not appear in the uh, in the in the Light Rider fixtures list. If I hit refresh, um, it's going to disappear. Okay, right. So to purchase Artnet, we go into Settings, and then I tap the Buy Artnet button. Okay, wait for the uh, pop-up box to appear, uh, and it will see. You'll see here that it uh, says Unlock Artnet Light Rider. DMX lighting control in app purchase, my account details, and the price of £84.99 if you're in the UK. I'm going to tap purchase, and I'm hoping that's going to prompt me for my Apple ID. Okay, tap sign in, and this should then ask me to uh, hopefully verify that, it's saying it's done. Okay, and I'm now, I should have purchased the Artnet add-on. Okay, hopefully it was that simple. Here we go. You are all set. Your purchase was successful. Tap the OK button. Purchase complete. Your Artnet purchase is complete. Jolly good. Okay, now to test this, uh, I need to then disconnect from my home network, reconnect to my J Airstream DMX bridge. Wait for that to connect. Okay, that's all looking good. And then restart Light Rider or we'll return to Light Rider. Tap the button, hit refresh. This should then find my ADJ Airstream DMX bridge. And hey presto, that's all looking pretty good. Uh, no warning messages now to say that my uh, Artnet purchase was unsuccessful. In fact, it's all looking very good. So it rather looks like I'm now licensed to use Artnet uh, within Light Rider on this iPad. Um, I've no idea whether it will work on another iPad uh, signed into the same iTunes account. Um, I don't have a second iPad at the moment, so I can't really test that. But uh, I'm sure if other people have done that, then they can um, they can comment here too. Uh, but otherwise, I'd say that was looking pretty successful and pretty uh, pretty simple too. Nothing too complicated there. Actually, one thing we could check is uh, is settings again. So I'm just going to hop in there, choose settings. And yes, look, you'll see at the bottom, uh, rather than uh, the message before, it now says ArtNet enabled, which I guess is positive feedback that ArtNet is properly enabled on this iPad. Good. So I know I've heard some people saying they've had a few issues with that, certainly with um, uh, pending transactions um, and also struggling to actually find the item. So um, there you go. It really is that simple. And I hope uh, that helps uh, at least, uh, you know, kind of so few people uh, see what they're up against before they actually go ahead and do it. OK, that's it for now. Uh, if you've got any other questions on this or anything else, then please head over to the uh, Facebook Light Rider Help and Support group um, where uh, myself and a good few other people are always around to, to help. Um, and uh, But anyway, uh, that's it for now. So see you next time. Thank you.